Good evening, welcome to the Daily Office, and thank you for joining me. This is Night Prayer for Friday, November the 6th. It's the 23rd week after Pentecost and week 4 in the Psalm Cycle, and the scripture for this service, Psalm 69, verse 30 to 36, and Revelation 15, verse 1 through 8. And please join me in singing verse 6 of Psalm 95 to the tune of Pure Nobis. All praise to you, eternal God, and Jesus Christ, our Savior. Holy Spirit, three in one, our light and our salvation. Our help is in the name of God Most High, the Maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. together. O merciful God, we have sinned through our own fault in our thoughts and words and deeds and in what we have failed to do. We have not loved you with our whole hearts. We have not loved our neighbor as ourselves. We beseech you, overlook our faults, cast our sins behind your back, that we may serve you and praise you all the days of our lives. Amen. And may Almighty and merciful God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh God, come to my assistance. Make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia, I will praise your name with a song and glorify you with thanksgiving. Alleluia, Psalm 69, and please recite it with me. Alleluia, I will praise your name with a song and glorify you with thanksgiving. This will please you better than ox and bullock. The humble shall see and be glad, and God-seeking hearts shall be revived. For you hear the cry of the poor, and you do not despise prisoners in their chains. Let heaven and earth praise you, the seas and everything that moves therein. For you will save Zion and rebuild the cities of Judah, that the people may live there and possess the land. The children of your servants shall inherit it, and they that love your name shall dwell therein. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia, I will praise your name with a song and glorify you with thanksgiving. Alleluia. A reading from the Revelation to John, chapter 15, beginning at verse 1. And then I saw another portent in heaven, great and amazing, seven angels with seven plagues, which are the last, for with them the wrath of God is ended. And I saw what appeared to be a sea of glass mixed with fire, and those who had conquered the beast and its image and the number of its name, standing beside the sea of glass with harps of God in their hands. And they sing the song of Moses, the servant of God, and the song of the Lamb. Great and amazing are your deeds, Lord God the Almighty. Just and true are your ways, King of the nations. Lord, who will not fear and glorify your name? For you alone are holy. All nations will come and worship before you, for your judgments have been revealed. After this, I looked, and the temple of the tent of witness in heaven was opened. And out of the temple came the seven angels with the seven plagues, robed in pure, bright linen, with golden sashes across their chests. And then one of the four living creatures gave the seven angels seven golden bowls full of the wrath of God, who lives forever and ever. And the temple was filled with smoke from the glory of God and from his power, and no one could enter the temple until the seven plagues of the seven angels were ended. Here ends the lesson.
And now let us offer our prayers and petitions. And please respond, hear our prayer. We thank you for bringing us safely to the end of this day. And we thank you for all the blessings you have granted us. O oh God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Deliver us from hardness of heart. Forgive us our sins and offenses, that your light may show forth from us. O oh God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. For all who seek you, tender God, that they may find and be found. O oh God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Rejoicing in the fellowship of Francis and Claire and all your saints, let us commend one another in all of our lives to Christ our God. O oh God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And for all of your intentions. O oh God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Together. Our beloved, which art in heaven, Holy is your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Let us pray. We praise you with our songs, O tender God, and glorify you with our thanksgiving. Accept our humble offerings and revive our hearts. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bless Jesus, my soul, and may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all now and forever. Amen. Alleluia.